Well, hello and welcome to this exercise on frequency density and frequency and histogram. It is a high tier IGCSE question and therefore uh, suitable for an IGCSE question as well. Now, I've done a bit more than you normally do in an exam situation. And because this is a, a, a revision channel, I've done a bit more than that. It's not difficult, but it, it's a bit more, it needs a bit more uh, thinking uh, than you would normally do. And so, and the first question says, uh, calculate an estimate for the number of trees with height in interval 4.5 to 10 meters tall. Okay, so uh, we need to notice here that each of these divisions is 0 0.4. So that's 4.4, 4.8, 5.2, 5.6, 5.7, 6, and then 6. So 4.5 will be somewhere in the middle there. Now, we've got from 4.5 to 10, and that's the distance from 4.5 to 10 there. So we, we'll be considering the squares within this region here. Okay? And there are six complete squares. Okay? And each square from this key given to us here, now each square is worth 20 trees. So 6 times 20 will give us 120 trees. In addition, we got these little squares here, and this one here, and they added to uh, um, 44. And then we got a half times eight there because we've got eight squares there and we're taking half of that we just assume that half of that will be uh, will give us four so if we add four to 44 we have 48 trees and 48 is now enough 50 little squares and we know that 25 squares will give us 20 trees so 50 squares will give us 40 trees so if we add 50 sorry if we add 40 to this 120 from there from these six squares there, we got 160 trees there. Okay, next slide. Right, now, the second question says, um, there are 75 trees with height in the interval 10 to 30 meters tall. Uh, it says, use this information to complete the histogram. Now, what we then have here if we assume that this is one unit area here, okay, so now we want to find how many unit areas are occupied by 75 trees. Uh, this is what you've got here. So if we divide 75 by 20, we get 3.75 uh, unit area occupied by 75 trees. Okay. Right now on the uh, H axis, the, the, the height axis here. Okay, now from 10 to 13 occupies uh, 1.5 unit length there. Uh, our unit length will be that given to us in the uh, key, so that's one unit length there. So that will be 1.5 unit length there. Okay, now now, we now need to find the vertical height of this area occupied by the signified trees. Uh, not forgetting that this area will be equivalent to 3.75 unit areas there. Now, we've got this uh, horizontal length of, oh, sorry, horizontal length of 1.5, so we need to find that, the vertical length there. And to do that, we divide the 3.75 by this horizontal length of 1.5, and then we get uh, 2.5 unit lengths vertically. So that is going to be one and two, and then 2.5 unit lengths there. So this area is occupied by the 75 trees. I hope all that made some sense, and thank you for watching. Bye bye now.